with the people. So in this video, I'm going to talk about my ideal land and purchases I might make to uh, to increase to increase the uh, what's it called? Well, the points or ideal land points because I need to get the five thousand to upgrade my ideal land to level five. It's level four. Well, let me show you my ideal land. I spent a little bit of time making it look. Uh, Somewhat aesthetically pleasing, but you have to you have to pay gems for uh, these stone tiles. I think it's like 50 gems per each brick road. That's what it's called, brick road. But um, I spent a little bit of gems on that. But basically, where I'm at with my ideal land is I have I think it's inventory that shows the ones that you have. So so it's um the the ones you don't have will be grayed out. So I'm, I'm missing two, but I'm also missing um, the Notre Dame de Paris. I thought it was a bad deal compared to anything else. It's not on this list and, and you know, grayed out. Like, I don't have these two. The Palace Athena statue is from a fame. And um, I'm not sure where the coronation fountain was at. So, so this is what my ideal land looks like. Those are the points I have accumulated so far. But the main part of this video that I want to discuss is if I do any purchases, how do I want to go about it? So you get the most amount of points per per what you spent on just the first two levels. So that's basically all you need to know is um, the first two levels, you know, getting the ideal land at, uh, getting the ideal land ornament in the first place is going to give you 50 points. Right, and you only need one of them to get level one. Then you only need one of them again to get to level two. After that, you still only get 50 more points per level. But it, it's, to get to level two to level three, you need two more of the ornaments. So what I'm going to do is I have a couple of these leveled up to ten. Right, so this one's level ten. Rose Spring is level ten. Red Demon Statue is level 10. This one's level 8. This one's level 8. And then the rest, I think, of everything is level 1 or level 2. So that's what I'm going to do on the rest of my ornaments is get them to level 2. So I have a bunch that are at level 1. And I have a few that are level 2. That one was level 2 also. That's level one. I think all all of these are level one, and all of these are level one. So, so, so that's that's what you want to go after if you want to get some ideal land points for the cheapest amount of money you can spend. You get them all to level two first. So that's that's what uh that's what I'm gonna do. And the spacing is you can see all these kind of grayed out boxes of how much bigger the ideal land when they did the ideal land increase. So if I get more than that, I can fit, you know, one more on this side, one more on this side inside the forested area, but they're three by three blocks. So I can put, you know, I have four blocks on both sides or only three blocks on this, on the right side. Three blocks on the right side, which they're three by three. And there's four blocks on those other, on the other three sides. And I think that, I think that has to do with that has to do with the spacing. Yeah, I have spacing. Yeah, the, the spacing is uh, off a little bit between the bottom right and the top left because I have a line of, I have a line of, uh, of these ornaments made. Weathered stone wall. I have a weathered stone wall all the way across. I can remove that, shift these, um, shift these uh all these trees up one remove that wall but um yeah so that's where i'm at and how i'm going about ideal land and uh the cheapest way to get to reach the next you know point level that you need for upgrading your ideal land so i'll just show that mine's at level four next one's at level five i think it will be worth it for me to get to level five reasonably soon um, and get, what is it, 
is 5% more construction, and then all troops hit points attack defense. I think it will be worth it for me to get to 5,000 points. So that's how I'm going to go about it. I'm going to get everything to level 2, and you know, this is going to take a couple more months, and more ornaments will come out, which I can get the level 1 and level 2 of, and hopefully I'll, I'll reach 5,000 points without having to take any more of them to level 3 or higher. So that's, that's how I'm going about my ideal land after I did, you know, you're going to have to do a couple of them higher than level three to get to 5,000 points. I showed I had three of them at 10, right? But uh, yeah, that's ideal land. I just wanted to make a video about that because I never, uh, I've got like 90 videos on Ebony content so far. And I've never made one about ideal land. I think mine looks pretty well. A lot of, a lot of content creators, ideal lands that, that I've seen. It just has all the ornaments thrown somewhere on the plot. It doesn't. It doesn't look like it's uh, fed up in a way to be visually appealing at all. They're just on the plot, so they have the uh, so the player has the statistics, right? <laughs> Anyways, my ideal land looks GG. If I had the Notre Dame de Paris, I could put it right in the center here. But I guess the message board in the center is uh, is a good spot as well. All right, I, ho I hope you guys like seeing my ideal land. Thanks a lot. And let me shut down OBS. Okay.